All right, we're on to update number two. If you're new here, hi, hello, welcome. If you're not, welcome back. My name is Zoe, most people know me as ZA Reptiles, and we are down in the future reptile room for our second update. For our first update, we were painting the walls. Now we are moving everything to the back over here so that we can prep the floors for painting. Once the floors are done, it's like full steam ahead. Right now, my biggest challenge is moving the washer and dryer and the fridge and the big row tent that I think I'm gonna have to just tear down. I mean, I'm getting rid of it anyway, or maybe not getting rid of it, but like, I don't know. I don't know, I don't think there's enough room back here for me to like, just kind of tuck it back out of the way. We'll see, maybe I can make it work. All right, half of the basement scrubbed and cleaned. We're gonna save the other half for tomorrow because it's late and I really wanna go to bed and I'm sick of carrying buckets of water up and down the stairs. All right, next morning, we've moved the washer and dryer, which means I can scrub this side. So I just started, going to finish, so hopefully tomorrow I can start painting. All right, it is time to put the primer down. I'm really hoping I can get away with just one gallon. We're gonna see how far one gallon gets. If it doesn't cover the whole thing, well, whatever, I'll just paint. Um, but we're gonna see how far that little guy can get us. Unfortunately, because there's stuff down here that we just couldn't bring upstairs or out of here, and I didn't feel like breaking down the grow tent, this area has stuff in it, and this area is supposed to get painted, at least some of it. But for now, we're just gonna go straight across, and if I have to paint it afterwards, I'll paint it afterwards. But for now, we'll just focus on the main area. So let's get to it. Oh yeah, a little bit goes a long way. I did one little splash and I got like a quarter of the basement. So yeah, if you're doing something like this, you definitely only need one can. I got two cans of paint so I could do two layers, but as far as the primer goes, I think we'll go with one can. kind of see what the reptile room is going to look like. I am so excited. Finally done edging half of the basement. And now we're going to do the floor. All right, the basement floor is done. Both coats, are you ready to see it? I don't think you are. It looks so good, so bright, so clean and welcoming. shiny everything is so bright and it just feels so I don't want to say bright again but bright down here it's not dark and scary like it was when it was green it doesn't look dingy and dirty we're gonna ignore that side it doesn't look dingy and dirty it got a massive facelift and it just feels so much nicer down here so our next step is to tear down this grow tent that I put off tearing down. Now I have to actually do it. I have to tear down this grow tent so that Billy can build the wall that goes across here for the closet and then move this stuff around so I can not only finish painting this little bit of floor, but so Billy can build the closet or the door, the wall that goes across here as well. From there, we do the electric and hook up a sink over here so we can have our little kitchen area. Unfortunately, all of that costs money. So I have a lot of bills I have to pay right now, which means my money has to go towards my bills and the things that are very urgent, which means I don't have extra fun money to put into the basement to keep the progress going. So I was hoping I'd have more of an update for this video so it wasn't just like, hey, I'm painting the basement floor and that's it. I wanted a bit more, but I don't have the extra money to spend right now to make it more. So this is what you're getting. You're just getting a floor update for right now. If you wanna help me keep moving and grooving along down here, make sure to support my channel, hit that subscribe button. But also, if you want to financially help, you can shop my Etsy store where I sell artwork, goodies, decor, you name it, apparel for reptile keepers. So as always, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you for the next video and hopefully soon, this will be the reptile room where we will always be filming.